The Wheaton Terriers are really outgoing, bouncy, playful dogs. Known for their spunk and lightheartedness, their fluffy coat and terrier build say it all. Let's say it's a guy and a girl who's getting the dog. The girl can feel like she's gotten herself the fluffy, cute dog, but the guy can feel like he's gotten a dog that's manly enough. While certainly the neighborhood jester, they do have energy and it needs to be released. It's a dog that is extremely high energy, very, very bouncy. Originally the beloved dog of Ireland, Wheatons were the working dog of the working class. Forbidden to own hounds, the common people put the terriers to work. They're originally bred to be farm dogs, used for herding, hunting small vermin. The Wheaton joins the Kerry Blue, the Irish, and the Glenavie Mall as the fourth terrier of Irish descent. The modern Wheaton is medium-sized with long terrier legs. Of course, if you get a Wheaton as a pup, the name can be deceiving. This is because Wheatons are born a rusty brown. It's only as they outgrow their puppy stage that their hair turns that gorgeous Wheaton blonde. And as this happens, they develop this soft, luscious coat. Most terriers have this harsh, kind of rough, broken coat, but not the Wheatons. The Wheatons have a very soft, silky kind of coat. Wheatons have a single soft coat that feels more like silk than dog hair. Imagine your favorite teddy bear in the world come alive. It's that soft, and they're that snuggly, too. Atop this soft teddy bear of a pup is a long blonde tuft of hair. They have this thing called a fall, and it's this big piece of hair that hangs down over their eyes. They also have a long beard under their chin, giving these terriers a unique look. And hidden under their bangs and beard is the telltale terrier trait, the teeth. Yes, as soft and sweet as this pooch is, it has those terrier fangs. <laughs> Turns out you can breed the aggression out faster than you can the fangs. And with Wheatons, there will never be a dull moment. As for climate, good news. Wheatons can do pretty well in pretty much any temperature, hot or cold. However, this gorgeous silky soft coat comes at a price. Wheatons require a tremendous amount of grooming. Wheatons shed very little, so you have to brush the hair out daily. While Wheatons have such a merry disposition, they are really allergic to fleas. One bite can cause a reaction throughout the whole body. Another potential problem is protein wasting. They can't digest the proteins properly, and they actually start to lose weight. But when it comes to training, Wheatons shine. They really like to play and interact with people. So if you're using play training and reward-based training, then they're pretty easy to train. Now, while you should never leave a dog alone with small children. If you have kids and you want the kids to occupy their time for a while, put them in the backyard with the Wheaton. They'll play for hours. So the Wheaton. As long as you keep the Wheaton well walked, they'll be good in any climate. Their flea allergy can be tedious. They need daily brushing. Put in the training time early but they're really good with families. These soft, cuddly, animated fur balls are as fun as they are adorable. Play with them every day and they never lose their magnetic puppy spirit.